Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Today is a very interesting morning. What inspired you to ask for porridge in the morning? You rarely ask for porridge for breakfast. I'm hungry. You're just randomly hungry? I just hungry? want something warm. It's like 48 degrees. See, wait, do you want some? Okay. You just want something like hearty and soulful? I do. I do. I feel like I need a hug from the inside. What about I'm from the porridge. outside? I can give you a hug from the outside. And a hug from the inside. <laughs> I've never seen your eyes light up so bright. <laughs> you kidding me? I'm good. Yeah, so I'm making my bear like a miso porridge, which is really interesting. Ah, uh, miso porridge. And the minute she, <laughs> the minute she told me, she was like, "Hey, I want some porridge this morning," and I was like, "What?" It made me happy because my dead grandpa used to make me Jesus porridge. Jesus Christ! Just say my grandpa. Well, he's not alive. I don't want him to be confused. I don't think they care. Just say my grandpa. Okay. So my grandpa used to make me porridge every morning when he would come and visit from Taiwan. And he would take all the leftovers and make somehow the best porridge in the world. And it's even better than what was made the day before. So when she made me porridge and I knew how much happiness... I mean, when he made me porridge, I knew the kind of happiness it brought me. So I'm like, okay, cool. I'm going to hopefully give Marbury the same happiness. I was looking for a dried kelp in our pantry. Couldn't find it. So oh, so I threw far, it away. Oh, you did? Mm-hmm. I was old. Uh, so, so far, I only got rice, tofu, got some seaweed. I got mixed up an egg. So, I'll toss this in there. Um, I'm going to need two hands because when you want to put the egg to get it even, you want to slowly stir it and slowly, uh, slowly pour, slowly stir it. Can you help me? Oh, really? I didn't know that. Yeah, so it doesn't like, so it's nice and evenly cooked, so it doesn't become one big clump. So, like, I had no there. idea. No wonder. See, now it cooks everywhere, and it's nice and even like that. Cool, huh? See, now it's nice and thick and hearty. And add the seaweed last so I don't crush it too much. And there you have it. Very simple. Just rice, tofu, miso, dashi. And some seaweed for Ma Bear's morning porridge. Oh, and an egg. And now Taka could eat this too. Can I go? Yeah. Oh. Mm. Is that what you wanted? Oh, yeah, even better. <laughs> the kidney. Mm. It was bomb. Is it? Mm hmm. That's kidney. Super bomb. I made Tech a little one too. But his has to cool down because he always complains about things could be lukewarm. He's like, ha, 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 ha. So this thing is just gonna chill out right here. You give him so little. Really? Is she give him more? That's a little bit. Really? Yeah. Okay. I always give him at least half of the whole bowl. Oh, okay. I will. About to have shabu shabu for lunch. All right. I know what you guys are thinking. Are you guys just eating all day? Uh, no. I mean, Yes, we are eating, but no. Um, after we ate breakfast, we went out and trained, and then we played in the backyard, and I was hosing Taika down. If you watched Mob Bear Stories from today, you would have saw that. And if you guys did see that in Mob Bear Stories from by the time this video comes out, me from last week, um, let us know in the comments below. Yeah, I saw that. So we were training, having a good old time. And then now, Mob Bear and Monkey Bear Taika are watching Monsters, Inc., which is super cuny. Really wish that Disneyland was open because the minute the opening credits opened, it was playing that song. I was like this. I'm like, oh, I want to bring Disneyland so bad, but still not open just yet. But we are going to have Shabu Shabu for lunch, and I am so happy because I've been fiending for Shabu Shabu. And since where we live right now, it's like 20, 25 minutes to the Asian store, I can't always get the meats. So the other day when I was picking up some Korean barbecue, I was like, better get some uh, meat. So got some Shabu meat. I'm um, hooking up with some cabbage, enoki mushrooms are my favorite. This time I'm adding something different, cauliflower, to switch up the veggies. And when you guys are doing shabu shabu at home, it's a little trick. I'm not sure if I showed you guys before already, but this thing does take a little minute to get the water boiling. It's really good at maintaining temperature, but not good at creating like additional heat, if you know what I mean. So I like to boil water here, so it's way faster, like this. So the water that I put in is already piping hot. So now all this thing has to do is just maintain that temperature and not get it to boil because I don't know if anything's ever going to beat that. Turn that off 
and time to put the veggies in and we're gonna have a yummy lunch. I always love the food that I make for Taika when we're doing shabu shabu because he has all kinds of good stuff. This guy got um, shabu meat, cauliflower, enoki mushrooms, napa cabbage, tofu and rice and some ponzu. Hey monkey, you gotta eat dude, here. Go Come eat, in. let me see. Eat first. Good job. Is it delicious? <laughs> Cute. He's been deprived of it. Oh, you like Shabu Shabu too? Oh, uh, the phone. Oh yeah, he hasn't been on the phone all day. Out all day. Yeah. See, I'm, I'm so excited for you. Because I know how, how much you love it, I know how much I love it. I love it so much. I hope in Vegas that the Asian uh, market is even closer than here. But at least there won't be traffic, so we can just go there all the time. That's the pain in the ass about over here. Ow! It <laughs> really? You're just gonna wait and watch me? Yeah, I oh, love man, watching you eat. I feel so much pressure. Let me see. I'll do a little bit of this. No pressure, just want a great reaction. If not, the video's ruined. Mmm. <laughs> you just melted. Oh, that's a good reaction. Yeah, that's the kind of reaction I was looking for. Hey, I don't even make you do that. What the hell? <laughs> hey, hey. Now we're walking to the grocery store to do meal prep for the week. And this is super cuny because we get to walk as a family. <laughs> the guy that walks with an extreme amount of swag. And then we have Mobber that's just trying to not get in his way. <laughs> and then we brought his stroller. Not for him, but so when we come back with groceries, we can pack it up. He doesn't even fit in his stroller anymore. I know, he doesn't. When we took him to the zoo uh, two weeks ago, his legs were dangling off the front of that thing. Barely fits in this thing. We just played that song for him too. The I'm blue, the booty boo. The. One thing I'm really impressed about is um, this little guy. So it's about a mile to the grocery store. And we walk a mile there and a mile back like all the time. So it's super cutie. And he can hang. A little three year old dude. And those little legs do a lot of damage. One of our favorite parts of our walk to the supermarket is there's all these little stations. Go. And Taika gets to do all of them. What is that? The balance beam? Yeah. He wants you to see it. He okay. To Thank you. Whoa, you're good. <laughs> good good job. job. There you go. Good job, dude. There you go. Good job. Good job. Wow, that's really nice good. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. Yay, there you go. Job. Wow. Oh, you're doing great, monkey. You're awesome. Nice oh, it's okay. What is that? Taking a break? There you go. You there you go. Balance. No, 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 no. Do the forward like that. Yep. No, move your foot. Put the other foot in front of the other one. No, don't do it that way. You're cheating. <sighs> nice jump. Nice jump. High five. Mm, okay. Good job, Judy. I'm more <laughs> so I really like this walk because it's really peaceful. Look at this. It's like a nice little walkway. I just started the construction. I know. But it's really peaceful because you get to walk next to like all these suburban homes. And that's what it looks like behind us. It's a nice little walkway. And honestly, this is one of the reasons why we really fell in love with Vegas too. We love these walkways throughout all the neighborhoods and stuff. And so the city we're going to live in, it's called Summerlin. Um, there's walkways through all the neighborhoods. So it's super like dog walking, cycling, hiking, biking friendly. And since we like to do stuff like this, it fit us really, really well. And then we could do this, like go to the supermarket, buy yummy food, <laughs> and just have a good old family time. All right, so what does this station do? What does this one do? Pop up, pop up that thing. What does this one do, monkey? Pull-ups. Pull-ups. Okay, let's see. Let's see do pull-ups. So Almost hard. there. Too short. There you go. Mommy, <laughs> hey, good job. Good job, monkey. That's it. You just hang on it for a little bit. All right, next one. Next one. Let's go. Show me this one. What is this? Is that? Yes. <laughs> okay. I don't. Vertical climb. 
Vertical climb, wow. Climb out of jail. You can climb out of jail. Gotta climb out of jail and escape. There you go. Wow. Okay. That's good. That's good, dude. And can go higher. And go higher one more. Go a little bit higher or no? Go. You're scared? I'm right here. I'll help you. Go. You're not go last scared, one. Go. dude. I'm right here. You won't fall. Good job. There you go. Good job, Good monkey. Job. Watch your head, okay? Go one more. Do one more. You can do it. I'm right here. You can do it. You can do Mama it. Right there you go. You there you go. Put your foot here. I'll help you. You can do it. Jump up and do it with you? You can do it. <laughs> okay. You're going to get down? All right, since um, we're not gonna be able to walk back with the shopping cart, right? You guys saw I, we brought the stroller. So our groceries is limited to the stroller. No, no, and this looks ridiculous right now. We're just packing it all over the place, wherever things can fit. Found these pizzas, super um, low in fat compared to protein. Got snacks, so I could show some cookies, got some Greek yogurt. Got some chicken breast and milk back there. It just, just looks freaking ridiculous. Well, we'll explain why we got what we got when no, we get home. No. Okay. If anyone else is dieting along with us. What? Yes, Daddy, but still, I just see some very healthy snacks. You can eat 10 of them and it's only 60 calories. But it's just so funny that this is our shopping cart and we are limited to this. All right, let's go, monkey. No, no, no. Oh. All right, how did we end up over here? What? This one? You can't finish that, you crazy? Why? That's a giant cupcake. You want no cupcakes? There's no other ones? How do we end up over here? I wonder why. Man, these look delicious. You for sure are my son. Oh, that's still big, but that's delicious. I mean... Yeah, it's better than the other ones. Which one do you want? You want the chocolate one? The pumpkin one? The carrot? Yeah, these look delicious. Carrot cake? Are you kidding me? Oh man. Oh, that's too big. We need a small one just for you. Are there any small ones? No. That's not a small one. That's humongous. That's a cake. This guy's crazy. We're looking. We're looking for cupcakes, and this guy's pointing at cakes. Ooh, what are those ones? Are those frozen? I don't know. They're just. They look bomb, though. Oh man, he's my son for sure. He loves all kinds of stuff. Either that or I've just never evolved and I have kid taste buds still. <laughs> they I, both sound like they work. Because I love pastries, I love sweet stuff. Where are you oh. Okay, our cart yeah. is, okay. this is the most ridiculous I've ever seen it. What in the world is this? <laughs> our family has problems. Thanks for helping, me, mister. Okay. Yeah. Can we put that up there? It's heavy. Good job, dude. Just in there. Careful. Some of these are delicate, like these. Hello. Very Gentle delicate, pie. gentle. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, put those on. Those are light. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. The pizza. Yummy pizza. Oh, this looks so good. The bottom. Oh yeah, bottom. That's the guy. Yeah. Coke Zero. I just started drinking these guys. Isn't that crazy? Oh, help me! Thank you. Oh, you're strong. Here, I'll take it. I'll take it from the back. Gotta take it from this side. Here, give it to Mama. Don't drop it. Good job. Two more, okay? Two more. So I'm not a big fan of that aftertaste of like the artificial sweeteners. But then I found out if you squeeze a ton of lemon, it actually covers up quite a bit. And since I love, love, love Coke, um, I actually tried it on Coke Zero, zero calories. And I put lemon on there and it was good. Not as good as real Coke, but it's, when you're fiending for it, but you still want to stay on a diet, it really helps out. No, we don't need another one. We got too many desserts. No. We got too many. Put a, You've never even ate that before. Um, Thank you. Thank you for putting it back. Thank you. 
Yeah. You're a good boy. All right, this is crazy. I can't believe we made it work. Look at this. We well, got we bags. We haven't made it home yet. So I don't know if we've made it. Home That's yet. true. It might okay. all fall off. But so far, we got the drinks with the Red Bull Coke Zero milk down there. We got bags here. We got the pizza here. This might looks like it might fall off, but hopefully, I have faith. We are masters of Jenga, and I think this will work. The CUNY. I love seeing them together. Makes me so happy. Look at those CUNY shadows on the ground. Look at this. Can you believe we actually made it home? We walked like a mile, maybe a mile and a half, without it falling off once. Shout out to this stroller and my driving skills, because we made it. Oh, you're gonna have to help me. I can't go up this step, huh? The only time you driving here? Thank you. Hey, I drive good when it counts, okay? How come our house smells like poop? Did you poop on the floor? No, <laughs> what? I pooped on the table. Alright, so this is the pizza I was telling you guys about that has pretty good macronutrient count on it. So if you look at it per serving, what, mister? Okay, good job. So per serving, there's 8 grams of fat, 14 grams of protein, and that's not bad. And there's six servings per container. I'm guessing that's six slices. So for someone like me, I could probably eat this whole thing by myself. So that means I would have gotten 50 grams of fat, like 48, and then six times 14, that's 84 grams of protein for under 1,500 calories, which is crazy good. So if like, let's say during lunchtime, I got a salad with a vinaigrette dressing with lean protein on the side, and then later, as a snack, I had a protein shake that was low in fat, low in carbs. For sure, I can fit this in and still be on track to losing weight. So that's why when I saw these, I was like, oh my God, I freaking love pizza. And anytime that I'm able to fit pizza into my diet, it makes me so happy. Here's some other snacks I was telling you guys about that are really good for dieting. This one is 60 calories per 10 cakes. So super low cows. Uh, as with rice cakes, super low cows. Um, this vegetable medley, in tomorrow's video, I'll show you guys why I have this, and I'll show you like one of my fit and fabulous um, like cooking recipes uh, that'll taste good, help you meal prep, you can cook a lot at once, and it uh, will help you stay on track to lose weight too. Got some strawberries. Then we got this to go with our matcha at home. Shout out to Jumbi Matcha. Always drinking it in the mornings. Oh my goodness. Always drinking it in the mornings to wake up. And we just like to sweeten it in different ways. And caramel, it's really yummy. I like the pumpkin spice, that's really yummy. Got some oats. Got some chicken thighs, as you guys saw. And uh, the real girl you guys already saw. So pretty much, yeah, my whole grocery Shopping besides this for the little dude. I'm not even gonna eat this even though it looks delicious. Can I eat half at least? Oh cool, I might be able to eat one. One cookie is only four grams of fat. 90 calories. I guess it's under 100. I might be able to eat one depending on how big it is. Big it is. Um, but yeah, everything is for me to get lean. And so that's really my goal this year. I wanna be the lean, leanest and the strongest I've ever been. It was supposed to be my 2020 goal, but you guys know what happened with last year, what we all went through. Still ran a marathon last year, which is pretty cool. Didn't get close to squatting, and did get close to squatting 500, but ended up at 475. This year, I'm going to hit 500 for sure, and uh, I'll do it at my leanest, too. What are all of these things? A gun. All your tools? No, my gun. Okay, what are we going to play? Are you going to play Smack Yourself? Are we gonna stay inside or we go back outside? Because if we stay inside, we gotta take our shoes off, okay? What? What? You wanna play badminton? Badminton? Yeah, that's with the racket. The racket you're throwing. That's badminton. You wanna play badminton or no? What? 
Sometimes I don't even know what he wants to play. He just goes, let's play. I'm like, cool, what do you want to play? What do you want to play? Oh, don't do that. You're going to break the tree. Ooh, don't do that. You're in a big trouble. And I know why you look there, because mom's right there. And you're going to get in big, 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 big trouble. So what do you want to do? Oh, no. Uh-oh. We got a little crab on the loose. Oh, no. Let's get out of here. Hey, oh, oh. Hey, hey, this crab got up. Oh, yeah. Ay, 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 ay. I'm a crab. Eat the crab. Eat me. Eat, I eat you? Yes, I'm a crab. I ate you. It was delicious. Bye. Let's see what. You could just leave after I eat you? Yes. Are you sure? Is that how this works? Yeah. I think if I eat you, you're gone. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> okay, see you later. Go in the water. I'm a crab. You're, you're what? You're, what are you now? I'm, I'm, a, I'm a frog. You're a frog? Rabbit, rabbit, rabbit. What is this? Buddhism? We're just rabbit, reincarnating? Whatever? Rabbit, uh, hey, rabbit, hey. Rabbit. This is reincarnation all the time, huh? Your favorite. There we go. We finally got it. Is it yummy? Did you take off the paper? Not yet. Take off the paper. Don't eat the paper. Is it everything you dreamed of? Mm -hmm. Here, Papa, help you. Okay. Don't spill it. Bring the bring the blue plate. Bring the blue plate. Bring it close. There you go. Now do it over it. There you go. Fine blue da ba -dee, da ba da. Mmm, is that everything you ever dreamed of? Mm -hmm. Are you living vicariously through him? What the hell is this? Yeah. Oh, he's having such a good time. Mm -hmm. Alright, on that note, we're gonna spend some CUNY quality time today and just enjoy ourselves. Thank you guys for following us on our adventure to the supermarket with the stroller and we made it back safely. So we didn't spill anything, didn't waste any food, and my bear's cleaning out the fridge now so that we can put everything nice and neat and get ready to start the week. Tomorrow, I will be sharing my recipe of um, uh, how, to meal prep. how to meal prep, something that's tasty while still very low on fats and low in calories, so stay tuned for that. Good night, or <laughs> what happened, what happened? I dropped eggs. Eggs? Oh my God, good night everyone.